All right, I'm with <laughs> Kelly Emmett from the uh, from the Giant Factory mountain bike team. We love talking to Kelly because she's always in a good mood. Why oh, is thanks. that, by the way? I don't know. Why are you so positive all the time? I got a pretty fun job, you know? What's there to complain about? <laughs> so, yeah, I mean, you ride dirt bikes, you ride mountain bikes, you ride Super D, cyclocross, yeah. road bikes. I like to mix it up. What's your favorite? If you could only own one bike. I think it's my dirt bike. <laughs> your days. dirt jumping bike. No, no, no. <laughs> my dirt bike motorcycle. No. Oh, God. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Um, my mountain bike. I love to mountain bike. It's where I started. It's my passion. So, yeah. Yeah, I really like it. So you're back home in Colorado Springs. Mm-hmm. And, oh, yeah. so, and you're getting fit for cyclocross. Yes. W what's going on? You're doing a whole season or what? Well, we're not, um, I will be doing a lot of cyclocross, but I'm not focusing on any one series. So um, I'm traveling around with the guys. We're trying to get UCI points to get good start positions in um, for the Nationals in Bend this year. So we're kind of just picking and choosing some of the races that fit into our schedule. So I'll come back and do New York um, and New Jersey, and then I'll do Portland, Boulder Cup, and Nationals in Bend. So will you be staying with your teammates in Bend? Adam I Craig don't know. Carl I, I Decker. Carl the email the other day, like, uh, Carl, I just want to double check and make sure. So uh, I haven't heard back from him yet. So <laughs> they got, they have to let you in. I'm not sure it'll be good for your racing, but they have to let you in. I know. Yes. Definitely. I've I've heard a rumor that Ryan Trebon lives a quarter mile from the race course. Yes. And he's taking guests. Oh. He and his all dog. Right, all right. He and his dog George, if you need a, a need a place to stay. So anyway, right. back to Colorado Springs. Yeah. I got to ask you about our good friend Katie Compton, your trading partner. Yeah, what do you think? Definitely. She going all the way or what? Well, I hope so, man. She works hard and deserves it, and you know she's been so close so many times. We all love to see that happen. So yeah, I think I think this is a year. For she's her. looking really fast this year. And yeah, she is. She's faster than she's ever been. And thinner and focused, and she's yeah. finally got a good sponsor. Yeah, yeah, yeah. exactly. Speaking there. of Colorado Springs and Rock Shock and Shram. How's the boyfriend behaving himself? <laughs> he's doing all right. He just made it back home. He's been doing yeah. media camp in uh, in Moab, so he's been riding in Moab all week. So he's got a tough job too, but he seems to be managing pretty well. You know, we have tens of thousands of viewers who are wondering if you're still single or, or, oh, or engaged. Oh come on! Or what, oh come on! I mean, we get emails all the time. So, so no, you don't. You those guys, that. they had a they had about a six month window of opportunity, but <laughs> Kelly Hammett off. She's, she's off the market again. So I want to ask you about 2010. So mountain bike world championships coming to North America. Yeah, awesome. Um, what do you think? Are you, are you going to go excited. all the way and do Worlds next year? And yeah, definitely. I mean, I was really hoping to get to Australia this year and do Worlds, but had an injury, you know, at the middle, end of July, really. So that kind of put me out. But, uh, but no, I mean, it's, it's always the goal every year, you know, is to get to Worlds and get the best results I can. So you'll go all the way, you'll do the race in Wyndham, drive yeah. up the road, Mount yeah. St. Anne. I know, I mean, that's in the backyard, that's awesome, it's great. It's yeah, great. you know, just just when we think we got you figured out, you know, a few years ago I said, okay, Kelly Emmett, great uh, cross-country racer, you know, wins at Santa Ynez. And then I'm saying, well, wait a minute, she's doing well in short track, and then you start kicking butt in Super D. And then you start doing these epic races like Downeyville and downhill races and, and, and then you go to Cross Vegas where everybody says, oh yeah, it's nice to see Kelly and then you go out and spank everybody. <laughs> okay, so <laughs> it's, it's, it's hard to figure out what you're really best at, but I mean, if you, what, what is your favorite? Is it still cross country or? Yeah, cross country is, it's my passion, yeah. you know, again, like I said earlier, it's where I started racing and uh, yeah, I mean, but some of these other events are really fun and I like to mix it up. It keeps racing a little bit more light and you know, it's just not like racing XC every single weekend. You know? so, so what so was like your favorite fun. event of this year? I gotta say Downeyville was quite amazing. You know, it's yeah. the coolest vibe and the, you know, people are just having a great time on their bikes. They're just so happy to be out riding some of the best trails in the country. So. Um, I love I love Downeyville, so I'm gonna go back next year. So do you think that race is just gonna continue to grow and? Yeah, I mean I think it's got some limited space issues. So I mean the popularity I think will continue. It's like ten well. motel rooms in the town. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I mean we camped in an RV, so um, you know there's not a lot of places to stay, and I think there's only so many people that they're gonna let in. So, but yeah, it's it's definitely an epic race that will stick out in my so, mind. So you know not that you do poorly anywhere, but what, what is your least favorite? Uh, 
race course, uh, given your skills uh, to race on? My least favorite? Yeah, if you had to pick one. I mean, as much as like CNES, it was great to win, but I gotta say, the course I thought was terrible. <laughs> what is it? Is yeah. it the cow poop that's bothering it's the you? Rattling, yeah, cow poop. It's 115 <laughs> degrees. You know, your headset just... is loose after yeah, after the race because yeah, yeah. your teeth, your fillings are loose. And they're not real. There's rain ruts and not really a trail yeah. there. So that's you, stuff you have to admit they have the best wine though on the circuit. Yeah, yeah. that location is fantastic. Yeah. I have to say. So today's race looks like Katarina. Yeah. Katarina Nash is here. Mo Bruno's here. Yeah, um, Maureen is here. And uh, I'm not sure who all is here. How do you? Th I know you. You spend hours planning strategy. What's the yes. strategy for today? <laughs> I can't tell you my secret. No, no secret because I may go tell. <laughs> yeah, I know. I, I may know go you're tell talk Katarina. To Katarina next, so, all right. Uh, and, and Mary McCallaghan. So. And Mary's here. That's yes, right. Yes. Yes. Oh great. my. Always great to see her. Oh my God. Well. Yeah. yeah. Here's here's so my here's my day. advice. All Don't right. let Katarina get any gaps. I uh, know. <laughs> so, anyway, good luck today. Thank you so much. Thanks, Kelly.